What is up guys, Smitty Aliens here today with a new video and I would just like to welcome you guys to this video Welcome I got, I made a little list of things that you can't see anything of things I gotta go through in this video So, okay, so this video is about the wish fish trap net Down there Anyway, I'll do a review of that right now you guys can see the whole net situation how it looks, how it works and then we're gonna put it in a little creek or something which we're gonna find on Google Maps then I gotta ask them for a sub everyone that is new to the channel I do videos like this like fishing talking about the truth about becoming fishermen and YouTube fishermen the whole industry and I'm just gonna share my journey of becoming a full-time YouTube fisherman a lot of people are not believing in me to do that but I'm gonna keep hustling and keep pushing keep making videos and try and do it so if you're new to the channel Please hit that subscribe button and um, stay tuned. Hit that bell to get notified the next time I upload so you guys can comment on my videos. By the way, the comment of the gay, of the, okay, almost said gay. The comment of the day is pure chaos fishing. Thanks a lot for commenting on the videos. After I post the video, seeing all the comments come through, questions and things you guys gotta say, it really means a lot. I'm just gonna sit down, this camera's getting really heavy. All right, now we gotta review that net. Ah, there we go. Okay, so this is everything I need right here. Let's just zoom this in a little bit. Perfect. Okay, so first off, this is a little net. It's actually an orange bag, which uh, I'll explain that now. Then we got some food. It looks like I'm gonna have a blast, but no, this is for the fishies or whatever is gonna go inside the net. I honestly don't even know, cause uh, just the creek. Anyway, we got some meat from last night and a little bun. So we're gonna make a little hot dog inspired by Flair's fishing trap video uh, where he made a burger with the dog food. So that's the bait we're going to be using. And then the net itself. So this is how it looks. Bam. Let's just get some b-roll of this bad boy and show how it really looks close up and what's inside and all of that. So this wood piece up top is with some line so I can throw it out and get it back afterwards. So there's some weights at the bottom of the net just to keep the bottom of the net at the bottom. And then I actually put in two little water bottles that obviously has some air which is going to push the top of the net as high as possible. So when it's in the water, this it'll probably look just, just like this because these bottles are going to float and push the net up top. Well, hopefully that's my theory and I hope that works. Then there is some entrances at the side where the fish can come in and at the top. Honestly, I think there's too many and I think that if there was fish to go in there, that a lot of them would go out, would, well, would find a way to come out. So yeah, I'm not really sure how great it's gonna work, but this is a review, so we'll soon find out. So yeah, that's the gist of it. At the bottom, there's a little thing to open up afterwards to get the stuff out, so that's also pretty useful. I think next up we gotta go onto Google Maps and find where we're gonna put this thing to let it lay overnight and then tomorrow we can collect anything that's inside if there is even, even gonna go something inside, but. All right, let's try this again. So this is pretty hard with one hand, but it looks like there is a little creek. Okay, so you guys can probably see that little blue line that's running across there. Let's just check the satellite view. That looks like a creek, right? Leads underneath the road. Then it goes to, yeah, this is definitely, that was definitely a creek, but that's a, where is that creek now? Let's try, because that's the road, so let's try heading to that little bridge right there. That's actually where I released the, the bass, uh, which I caught. Well, let's try put the net somewhere here. <laughs> location right now this is actually one of the creeks I've been uh, exploring and having a lot of fun when I was really uh, small uh, catching frogs and stuff like that with Armand who's actually holding the camera right now but just look how clear it is absolutely gorgeous I don't see any life but uh, we'll see after uh, one day if there is something in this creek but uh, yeah let's just put this thing in the water awesome all right. Oh. <laughs> okay, so first off, I already put the, the bag full of uh, our, our little hot dog bun right there in the net. And I'm just gonna put a little bit of the other pieces of meat. 
outside in the net so if something does go in and they can't get the bread they don't they don't just try and escape but they try and eat the whole thing up I'm gonna put that little piece right in there so we're gonna just gonna try and so we're just gonna try and uh, and uh, a cop just went by I was like started shaking is this legal or not <laughs> anyway he's just like thumbs up so we're gonna try put the net in the middle of the little creek and really hopefully tomorrow there's something inside here so let's just chuck it it's gonna unroll this line I literally had a big fright I was like here comes a 2,000 grand fine or something <laughs> I'm not sure if this is legal but uh I'm just gonna chuck it there hopefully we can get something you ready okay let's try get that it's not sinking <laughs> awesome it is not sinking okay <laughs> okay let's just get take one bottle out and then try to get <laughs> okay what a fail <laughs> I thought the weight of the thing would put it down but obviously not let's try again still not <laughs> another fail you think I should leave it like that maybe at the top no it's just gonna float did one of my strings just snap no come on the first thing I can say about this wish net is uh, I just had a little snap one of the strings literally just snapped for some reason put two of these rocks in bam bam and this should be fine but I'm actually thinking that this line will snap hopefully not you gotta be kidding me. Armand is just laughing at me. He's like, this guy is an idiot. <laughs> oh, let's try that one more time with another rock. I'm actually scared that I won't be able to get this net back because it's too, he uh, too heavy. <laughs> but we'll obviously see tomorrow. Uh, where's a the rock? There we go. Let's hope this works now. Come on, buddy. We got some sink action. Oh, turn up, turn right up. Come on. Oh, it's going skew. Okay, it's not actually as easy as I thought it's gonna be. Okay, this is not gonna work, is it? <laughs> this is really frustrating. <laughs> My bread's floating. It's just failing right now. This is, this sucks. <laughs> All right, let's. We gotta figure. We gotta figure this out. Come on. Ah. All right. So one of the problems is the bread floats. So we need to do something with this little hot dog thingy we made. So we need to put a rock or something in here as well. Cool. Put that back in there. And we got to get the we gotta get the rocks in the middle because otherwise the net's going in skew. So let's try get the rocks in in the middle. It's gonna try get a nice swing. Let's hope that works. Come on, please, 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 please. It looks like it's gonna work this time. Okay, so the net is set after a massive struggle. Uh, let's hope they go something inside and that we can get some bugs or frogs or crabs or something all right let's get home i'm just gonna show you guys how this thing looks on wish i bought it for 25 dollars it's actually a lot of money for a thing that isn't even high quality i mean i casted the net out and literally one of the pieces of rope broke so that's kind of a bummer and um, i've bought something from wish which wasn't bad though so i've bought some rod socks which is absolutely awesome i think they were like a dollar and I'm really satisfied with them. So if you want to get rod socks or anything like that, go check out on Wish. Sometimes the quality isn't bad. So it's not always bad, so it's worth checking out. So there we go. $25 on Wish, and that's what it looks like. The thing is, that trap is actually used because we want to catch some bait. Let's say like crabs or some frogs or even small bait fish, like small pieces of catfish or whatever. I'm not exactly sure what we're going to get. But uh, maybe even a little tilapia or whatever. I've seen some tilapia in that stream when I was younger. But um, yeah, we'll just see what's going on in there and then hopefully there is something and then if there is something in the next video, we will use that bait to try and catch some fish, some catfish or some bass. So that's the whole idea behind the net in the water. And I wanted to do a review on the net because I got it last year and I haven't used it ever. So. And another reason why I bought the net was in the summertime, we, uh, we'll, we will be doing a lot of uh, pond stocking and relocating fish. From one pond to another and bait fish is going to be a big role in that because um, you need to have bait fish in a pond otherwise your bass isn't going to get big i think it's time to just wait all right what is up guys uh it has been just a little bit under 24 hours now we're headed to the creek there's three possibilities the one is the net is stolen <laughs> The other possibility is it is full of, I don't know what. And the other possibility is, which is probably about 80%, is, is that it's just empty. <laughs> so uh, let's hope it goes well. Stay tuned. 
Don't slip here again. All right, so that's good. The net is not stolen. That is achievement number one. Now we're gonna see if there's anything inside. Can't see anything yet. I see absolutely nothing yet. <laughs> that's not good. Okay, let's just open it up at the bottom. So that's open. Nothing? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> absolutely nothing. <laughs> Wishnet has failed us. All right, guys, so uh, I had the option to fake this and put some stuff in here, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna give you guys the real deal. It's empty, did not work, so uh, yeah, that's a bummer. We'll probably try that again in the summertime, hopefully. Yeah, <laughs> that's very disappointing. That is the wish net. I think the concept is great. It just didn't really work in the stream. It may just be the creek because, like I said yesterday, I didn't see any life. So we'll maybe try this somewhere else. Uh, another thing is it is winter, so it's really cold. But, um, yeah, I mean, 24 hours, there should have been something in there, at least crabs or something, so... Very disappointing, but uh, like I said, we'll do it in the future again. But thanks a lot for watching. Please uh, leave your comments in the comment section. And if you liked the video, even though we didn't catch anything in the net, please hit the thumbs up button. And um, yeah, uh, this video is coming out this week as well. I'm, I'm going to try and upload a little bit more, even though all the exciting stuff isn't always happening. Like I usually only upload videos where I catch at least three fish, for example. So I'm just going to share my experience with you if I catch fish or not. So uh, let, me, let me know what you guys think about that. And um, I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good day. Enjoy. God bless.